definitely want to turn the day off with some gratitude, thanking the Lord for all the blessings that we receive, and thanking Him for another beautiful day. So let's go, people! It's Transformation Thursday. And you know, we were talking yesterday, our Wealthy Wednesday, about relationships. And really that relationship with your life. Because a lot of times we can forget about that relationship, right? Because we can be busy and we can be running around and just really forgetting, you know, that we have a responsibility for what we've been given. And so a young man last night started talking about, you know, his job and working through third shift and, and, and really looking at his life as a whole and realizing that, you know what, the, the things that are in his life right now are, are, are things that he doesn't really agree with and doesn't like. And so I told him, I said, well, you know what, what you need to do is you need to have gratitude first, right? So don't first jump into dislike, right? Just start to uh, uh, agree that we have to start with gratitude first and look at our situation and say, okay, what am I receiving from this, right? What am I learning from this and what decisions had led me to this point? And you know what, once you come to that agreement and say, okay, right, what is this doing for me? Now, all of a sudden your attitude lifts up. Okay, your belief starts to lift up and say, okay, I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing right now. And then you start to fill up that bucket. And so I always talk about these buckets because you know what, when you, when you look at these elements of really what it is to be alive, it, it, it starts with you know, these buckets you have to fill up, such as, you know, joy and happiness. And then you break that down into, okay, what do those things mean to me? All right, well, family, relationships, friends, um, you know, coworkers, things like that. And then you just break it down even further, right? And you say, passion, right? What drives me every morning to get up to live my life? And so you have to fill these buckets up. But the relationship that you have with first yourself and accepting that, you know what, where I am is where I need to be right now because somebody has called me to be here. I'm gonna be the best version of me and I'm going to push forward, okay? And then being that one to realize the relationships that you create. I mean, a relationship, you know, within, you know, 30 seconds of standing in line and actually saying hey to somebody and saying hi is building healthy relationships. Or looking back at a friend or an acquaintance that you've been friends with for a long time and just embracing and nourishing that relationship. Finding out what Drives them. I got a phone call yesterday from a young man that I've been working with for, geez, you know, I don't know, three years now. And you know, it started out as it started out as business, but now it's transferred into so much, so much more, right? It, it, it transformed into so much more, and and now we're really good friends, right? And so you start to look at these relationships in your life, and you st you start to appreciate them, and then you start pouring love into them. And so on this Transformation Thursday, I want to encourage you to really start to build healthier relationships. Take the relationships you currently have, make them better. Find new people and new things to have a relationship with, you know, and start to build that trust and build that accountability. And more importantly, build that love of what a good relationship is and how rewarding it can be to have those things in your life. All right, y'all. So Transformation Thursday, turn it up, go out there, be the best person. Be the best person you possibly can be and continue to build healthy, creative relationships. It will go wonders in your life. God bless y'all. I'll talk to y'all soon. God bless.